disowned. Prince Harry in shock after King Charles disowned him and tripped off all titles. The once closed bond between Prince Harry and the rest of the British royal family appears to be irrevocably fractured, with allegations that he has been effectively sidelined by King Charles and Prince William. This growing rift, fueled by Harry's outspoken criticism of the monarchy and his explosive revelations about the family, has left the Duke of Sussex increasingly isolated. Royal author Christopher Anderson, known for his insider insights into the British monarchy, suggests that Harry has been gradually removed from any significant royal duties, a silent, yet effective, marginalization. This alleged ostracization is attributed to Harry's continued criticism of the monarchy's policies, a stance that has strained relations with his father and brother. The seeds of this bitter divide were sown with Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle's explosive revelations in their interview with Oprah Winfrey. The interview, which aired in early 2021, exposed deeply personal and institutional grievances, effectively sabotaging the monarchy's carefully cultivated image. Further fueling the rift, Harry released a controversial documentary, Harry and Meghan, that chronicled his and Meghan's struggles within the royal family. The documentary, which garnered global attention, deepened the divide between Harry and his father, King Charles, and his elder brother, Prince William. From the perspective of some royal commentators, King Charles and Prince William, the future king, have been ignoring Harry, prioritizing immediate concerns, such as King Charles's ongoing cancer recovery and the many challenges facing the monarchy. Anderson, a well-known media journalist, believes that King Charles and Prince William have deliberately sidelined Harry, strategically excluding him from important royal engagements and decisions. They have consciously chosen to not involve Harry in addressing the mounting challenges facing the monarchy, further isolating him. While Anderson acknowledges the complexities of the situation, he expresses sadness about the way Harry is being treated. He believes that love, not hate, should be the driving force in resolving family conflicts. He argues that King Charles and Prince William have bridged Harry away for a multitude of reasons, leaving him feeling ostracized and alienated. Despite the tension, Harry recently returned to the UK for the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, a charity he founded. While his presence at the event might suggest a thaw in relations, the underlying tension remains, highlighting the fragility of the family dynamic. The future of Harry's relationship with the monarchy remains uncertain. His outspoken criticism and continued separation from the royal family cast a long shadow over his future role and involvement in royal affairs. The public will be watching closely, anticipating how this royal drama unfolds and whether a path to reconciliation can be found. The rift between Prince Harry and the rest of the royal family is a stark reminder of the complexities of family dynamics, even within the most powerful and influential institutions. The future of their relationship remains shrouded in uncertainty, leaving observers questioning the long-term impact on the monarchy and the legacy of Prince Harry.